the family types dialog is relevant to every category of family. From here, you can create new variations or types in Revit terminology. By creating types within a family, you are limiting the need to create multiple families, making the content more efficient and flexible. In this example, I have a window family named Fixed Window, but I need to create standard sizes for my project. In the Family Editor, I'll activate the Home ribbon, and from the Properties panel, click the Family Types button. This brings up a dialog box where we can access the family's types. To create a new type, I'll pick the New button and provide the name 2 foot 0 by 4 foot 0. It's important to note the name has no direct correlation to the size or parametric values within the family. So next, I'll adjust the parameters Height and Width to assure that the size accurately matches the name. Notice that there are divisions of parameters within the Types dialog. These are known as parameter groups. Parameter groups allow you to more logically organize like parameters with one another. The grouping of a parameter has no effect on how it functions. It's merely provided to allow for better organization. Understanding the difference between instance and type-based parameters is also important when looking at the types dialog. With instance control, you allow each type of object to have unique control over that particular parameter. Instance-based parameters are easily found in the type dialog as they have a default suffix. This indicates that the starting or default value is defined from within the family, but can vary once inserted into the project. The Family Types dialog displays all parameters which have been created in this family. However, it is also possible to create parameters from this menu. To do so, you can pick the Add Parameter button and choose the kind of parameter choose instance or type based and finally assign a name to the parameter. The parameter now displays in the types dialog and can be used within the family editor to control the flexibility of content.